hey everyone, um, I'm making this video to help anybody who's gotten a corrupt profile or they simply can't open up the programs to mod the gamer tag. <coughs> um, you guys are gonna have to excuse me during this video. I may be coughing. I have a cold right now, so not that you care. But the first thing that you have to do, I'm just gonna show you guys how to mod your gamer tag without doing the easy GT part. So you want to open up USB Explorer and double not wait, double click content get your first profile extract it to your desktop like that now we got a profile here <coughs> so another thing oh yeah there's our profile that we're going to be modding so I'm going to show you guys how to open up these programs if you can't. You want to go to the internet. <coughs> and Google. Type in Microsoft.net Framework. You can get 3.5, don't get 2.0, that's outdated. Um, you can get 3.5 or 4.0. I have 3.5. I don't know why it just took me to this page, but it should say 3.5 or 4.0 right here. Once you're there, click download, and then you just want to be it says, and you'll be able to open up these programs. Um, if you're getting a corrupted profile, open Modio, because this is what causes corrupted profile. Either you moved, either you tried to mod one profile when you had two profiles on your USB or on one and you put it in the wrong folder, that gives you corrupted profile. I doubt any of you just understood what I just said. But another thing that gives you a corrupted profile is not rehashing and resigning. So, and a lot of you ask me where did my profile go? Um. If you lose your profile, you can recover it if you know your email and password. Um, if you get a corrupted profile, then just simply click on the profile and move it back onto your hard drive. And that will be your profile just normally. It won't say corrupted anymore once you click, once you move it back to your hard drive. So that's that. Um, this is really slow right now because my computer just got restored so it's not up yet but a lot of you have been asking me how to mod gamer score how to mod gamer score yeah like forcing me to make you know, I'm sorry I haven't really had time I'm having to do school online and everything so once I get some free time like I do now I'll make a gift score mod video look for it Sometime within before Black Ops comes out for sure I'll make one. But this is how you rehash and resign your profile if any of you got lost in that video. You, this is the updated version of Madia, so it doesn't look like it did when you click on M open a file from computer. Now this should load up. Go to desktop and find bottom file. So for now we're gonna pretend oh yeah, I forgot to say after you make your modded gamer tag, you'll get another folder on your desktop. So let me make this folder. It should look like this code, E0, whatever that says. I'm just gonna make this say modded G tag. Or a good a good tag, okay that works too. But let's pretend like this is our mod gamer tag folder. So you simply open it up and go all the way to the end until you find this piece of paper and it has your profile ID click on open wait for it to open it'll take a long time it's still loading you should get your gamer tag up here so appeared Xbox 360 profile in your gamer picture um once you do the modded one it should be a little monkey dude and then your modded gamer tag should be up here don't mess with file contents that could mess up all your stuff. And don't mess with details. <coughs> so 
So you simply click rehash and resign. It'll say rehash and resign. Wait for it to say Xbox 360 dashboard. So right there, and then you can exit out of it. Come on. Go back into this. I already went over to it. Alright. Open this back up. And this is where I lose a lot of you guys. Click open device. And then you want to double click on content. Your first folder here will be your non modded gamer tag. Right here, a lot of you are clicking inject and you can't find it. You want to click in folder. Find your modded folder. So, modded good tag. Click that. Click OK. This green bar should load all the way to the end. Once it's done loading, you want to pull out your USB, plug it into your Xbox, and see what you have. Um, it's not going to load for me because. Like you guys saw, I made this folder and there's nothing in it, so it'll say done right there even though it's not. So I'm going to delete that real quick. So yeah, you simply just take out your US and plug it in Xbox. Um, go over to storage devices, memory, it's the same way you got your profile on there. So, I hope this helps you guys. If not, message me on Xbox. Um, my gamer tag is on my YouTube page. So, I'm not using the gamer tag less than 3 anymore like I did in that modding video. I sold that account like a long time ago, about 5 or 6 months ago. So, message me on my other account. I'll try to help out as many of you as possible. I'd also like to say I'm sorry if never responded to your comments or messages that you sent me. Um, I can't respond to 300,000 people if they're having corrupt profiles. But, I try to respond to anyone that I can. So... Just message me on Xbox and I'll help you guys out. Alright, thanks for watching. I hope this helps.